Hey guys, this is Sebastian. Welcome to another segment on building your wealth in under five minutes. Today we're going to be talking about the 0% interest, the famous 0%. You see a lot of people are always trying to figure out if the 0% interest on cars, on credit cards, is it real or is it really a trap? We're going to be talking about that today. Now, before we go ahead and get started, don't forget, please subscribe, comment, share. We strongly, strongly rely on each and every one of you of sharing this content and distributing this content to as many of your friends and family. So let's go ahead and get started. So in simple words, these companies have been so smart for so many years and they understand that us, the consumer, the person that's buying the car, the ones that have credit card debt, we, the consumers don't like to pay interest. So they now put in front of your face on the TV, on your phone, they're telling you 0% interest. And now you gravitate towards that interest or gravitate towards that car because you think you're going to actually get a loan at 0%. Oh, that's looked a little high. I'm sorry to give you the bad news. You are not getting a 0% interest. That is not true at all. And I'm going to explain right now mathematically why that is. The first thing is credit cards. Credit cards, whenever they offer you the 0% interest for 12 months or for 18 months, usually they charge you something called a balance transfer fee. If you are transferring over other credit card debt, to that credit card debt. That means that they're gonna charge you upfront from day one, you transfer $20,000 of credit cards all into the new credit card that has 0%. They're gonna charge you upfront about three or 4% for something called a balance transfer fee. When you're buying a car, this is what they end up doing. They actually don't discount the car as much as what you actually wanted because they're giving you the 0% interest. So let's say that right now you were going to go and buy the car and the car was costing you $30,000 and you told the person that was selling you the car that you wanted to pay the 0% interest. They tell you, absolutely, don't worry about it. As long as your credit is good, we're going to give you the 0% interest. This is a very good price. You agree? So then you begin to negotiate on the price of the car or you begin to negotiate on the monthly payment, which is the wrong way to do it, by the way. That's a completely separate video. So now you begin to negotiate the price of the car and let's say you got them down by $4,000. So now you get a loan for $26,000 on the car and maybe you got that over 60 months or 72 months, whatever that, whatever the case of that is, right? Now, this is where it gets a little bit sad. they're going to give you a 0% interest on the 26,000. So maybe they're going to tell you $26,000 is your total payment over the next 60 months. So they just grab 26,000, they divide it by 60 months, and then they tell you that's your monthly payment. Now, this is the part that you missed. What you didn't know is that the dealer was willing to drop the price of the car from 4,000 maybe by down to $7,000 or $8,000. So they were actually willing to sell you the car for maybe instead of 26,000, maybe for 23 or 24,000, but they're only giving you a $4,000 discount because they're giving you a 0% interest. You see, dealers know this. They understand that people don't like to pay interest. So what they just end up doing is they don't give you the big discount. They might only give you a 10% or a 15% discount on the price of the car. You feel like you're getting a good deal. You saved yourself money. You feel like you're getting the 0% loan. But in reality, it's a trap. They are really charging you the interest. Nobody, no dealer, no credit card company lends money for free. Do not fall into this trap. This is what happens to countless of people every single day, every time they're walking into a dealer, every time they're going to a bank and they're getting the 0% interest. So what you should do is the following. Use the 0% interest in your favor for your benefit. So what do I mean by that? When you go in, don't try to tell them that you're going to get 0%. Don't tell them anything about that. Don't, you, don't, you shouldn't care about the 0%. Negotiate the price of the vehicle. Negotiate that first. Assume that you're going to end up paying in cash. Wow. Huh. 
you're amazing. And even if you don't have the money, what you always want to go and do is look for independent financing. That means you don't necessarily have to walk into the dealer and get the loan from the dealer or the bank that the dealer represents. You don't need to do that. You can go to your local bank. You can go to the credit union. You can go to online banks. Just literally Google online banks for purchases of vehicles, of, of purchases of cars, and you will see a ton of different companies that can lend you money to be able to go and buy your car. Don't fall into the trap of having to use their lender at the dealer and don't fall into the trap of the 0% interest. It's a complete waste of money.